Breaking news, my wonderful people, our very own brother, <laughs> former president of Nigeria, Chief Olushe Gwobasanjo, said, Nigerians, please, oh, please, I am begging. I did not, I did not, and I did not endorse Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu. Very recently, Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu's guys have, you know, gone on with the announcement making rounds that, um, you know, uh, former President Chief Olushe Gwobasanjo has finally endorsed Tinubu, saying that Tinubu is this, is that. Tinubu is that man, you know, that Nigerians must depend upon, that Nigerians must look upon, uh, you know, and um, he's the best thing that has happened, and Nigerians have to, you know, begin to align with him. Anyway, my one Wonderful people, these are some of the things that have been said. And guess what? Before you could say Jack Robinson, the man is already denying the matter. Say, ah, ah, ah. Hell skill smell. Hell skill smell. I don't know what you're talking about. I, I mean, me, no endorse anybody. Like, say, Kwanu, we say, Kwanu, where you endorsements come from? Hell skills me. I don't, I don't, I just know. I don't, does know. Eh? Anyway, my wonderful people, now waiting to happen with this. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. It's fake news, though. Don't accept it. Don't receive it. Former President Olushe Gwobasanjo denies endorsing Tinubu, says it is never true. The former President Chief Olushe Gwobasanjo has dismissed and has called fake news a, a viral message where he was quoted as endorsing the presidential candidate of the ruling or progressive congress apc ashiwaju ahmed bola tinubu and this parading the military saying tinubu is one of the best persons that nigeria have gotten now obasanjo in a viral whatsapp message was quoted to have said i am not a politician i am a decorated soldier an army general if you are looking for a thoroughbred politician of master class, visit Lagos, visit Lagos Jagaban. There you will find one. He is the person, to, is the person I'm referring to. Reacting to the claim through the special assistant on media, Kendi Akinyemi Obasanjo declared he never made any remark at the expense of his noble military profession. According to Obasanjo, only the military train personnel to be good managers of men and materials. So I cannot this parade my noble profession for my noble profession for politics, which has no formal training. This is fake and fake news, and nobody must pay attention to this. It is not true. I never said so. I never mentioned anything or such. Please don't listen to any of this. Not in a million years. I did not say anything of such. I never endorsed T. No Bo. So this is what is happening, my wonderful people. This is what is going on now. And in case you are not aware, you'll be shocked at some of the things that are happening that are going on. Okay, you'll be shocked and you'll be very surprised. The days upon us have come to show to us that, you know, people are doing everything to get to get other people to stay by them and with them. Okay, people are doing everything to get acceptance, to say certain individuals have endorsed them, certain individuals have done this, have done that, you know. So these are some of the things that are happening now. So my wonderful people, you can see for yourself that we all need to rise up to the occasion and do not allow ourselves to be deceived. Manipulation is one of the things that they are using to hold people down, okay? To, to, to say that, you know, this person, I've endorsed this person, that means that person has some level of credibility. Who are these people for them to even endorse anybody? Not everybody is totally, completely happy with Olushe Gwobasanjo. Some may, but not everybody. So whether... Obasanjo, Babangida, Buhario, any of those people endorses anybody. How does he make things different? What have they done that we must listen to them to go ahead and to do something for certain people? Uh, you know, what have they done? Why should we listen to them? Why should we, you know, obey them? Why should we, you know, listen? You, 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 see, you see what I'm getting at? 
But again, Obasanjo has come to say he did not endorse, you know, he never, he never endorsed, uh, you know, he never endorsed uh, Ashiwajo Ahmed Bola Tinobu, that the whole message, the whole thing that is being said is a lie. It's a serious lie, you know, being propagated, you know, by some persons. So my wonderful people, in case you have, they've deceived you into that very terrain, please be aware, it's not true. Okay, Obasanjo has said disregard is fake news. Somebody's just trying to use my name to gain relevance. I never said this. I never said that. I never, you know, associate, uh, you know, gave uh, acceptance to say it has to be this. It has to be that. Please don't get it twisted. Okay. So these are some of the things that are happening. And in case you are not aware, you'll be shocked at some of the issues, you know, that have transpired so far and why Nigeria is currently the way it is, you know, the nation that we are in. You know, people lie, people do all sorts of things. People, you know, do all sorts of things to ensure that they are the ones mm, who are getting who are getting the relevance, who are who are being accepted and what have you. If you have done well, you don't need to campaign too much. Your words will speak for you. Look at Peter Obi. Peter Obi, all he has to say to Nigerians, I have ruled in a state before. Go and check. My words speak for me. That's all. Nigerians on their own accord, not being pushed, not being coerced, not being given money, are rising up to the occasion and are saying, let us go on a march. The march you see on the streets, nobody gave them money. Nobody is, you know, nobody is pushing anybody. Everybody is rising up to the occasion and everybody is doing all they possibly can to ensure that, you know, they get the they, 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 they bring in a man who they feel comfortable with will make a difference. So what are you saying? What is your decision in all of this? What are you standing for? And why are you, you know, why are things the way they are? What are you doing to bring about this difference? What are you doing? How are we ensuring that the difference is being made? What are we standing for? Because as we stand for nothing, we, we stand, we, we, if we stand for nothing, we stand for everything. You see? We stand for everything. You see, my wonderful people, these are some of the things going on. These are some of the things happening. In case you are not aware, you'll be surprised. You know, you'll be surprised at some of the things following. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Remember, you have a voice. Let us speak together as one and reject everything and anything that have been holding us for far too long. God bless. Have a good day. Bye for now.